guys welcome back to my channel and for today's video i have another what i eat in a day for you guys i actually wasn't going to film this today and then i was making breakfast i was like you know what i'm just gonna film it i'm filming a tiktok of me making breakfast so you're not really gonna see me make breakfast because it's kind of already made but basically this is what i made my breakfast scramble and everybody's like oh my gosh you like i want longer videos of what i eat in a days and i want to see you making it and everything like that that is literally you open it you throw it in the pan it looks obviously without the egg and then you add six eggs but i do two regular i do two regular eggs and then egg whites for the rest and you kind of just eyeball it so that's what i'm doing right now that's why everybody's like yeah you should film your breakfast scramble there's not much to it so there's like really no point but i made a tiktok so if you want to go see the tickety talk go look on my profile because it'll be on there but yeah that's what i'm making for mm, kind of like lunch kind of kind of like a brunch it's 11 13 i didn't start like my coffee until like 10 50 i think it was i went straight into the office because i had to finish editing the day in my life for today which will already be up for you guys it would have been live wednesday and this is going live sunday i think but i needed to finish editing that that video is 18 minutes long which is like a really long video but you guys like said you wanted longer videos so that's what you get but yeah that's what i'm making for breakfast and that's really about it so i'll check in when it's lunchtime. i think i'm gonna try something new for lunch so I'm like really, really excited, but it's like not complicated to make either. So like, I don't know. Okay, but I'm gonna go eat some breakfast. Okay guys, I look like a crazy person. The dishwasher's on. So if you hear that, I'm sorry. Oliver's watching Encanto um, because he woke up from his nap and was grumpy and this usually cheers him up. So it's lunchtime. It's like two o'clock now. I'm honestly not that hungry, but I know that I need to eat. So this is, hold on. Let me show you. I got this at Aldi when I was there. When I was there. I don't remember when I was there. Whenever I was there last. And I saw it and it caught my eye. And I was like, okay, I need to try it. So it's a chicken flatbread Southwest style with barbecue sauce. This is what it looks like. It intrigued me. So I was like, you know what? Let's get it. So let's put the oven on let's preheat and we're gonna get a pan and Ooh, this is not easy one-handed they put a sticker over it this is what it looks like kind of looks fire not gonna lie it could go either way it could taste really good or it could taste really bad so i'm very curious it has mozzarella and cheddar cheese diced chicken breast tomatoes red onions jalapeno peppers barbecue sauce on flat bread crust so I'm gonna make it. I love a good flatbread and they have like a pepperoni one as well I think it was like three dollars with the coupon that they had on it. So I had to try it Let's see 10 to 12 minutes is what we're gonna cook it for and hopefully it comes out good I'm gonna wait for my oven to preheat. It says to preheat it to 400, but I always do 350 and just leave it in there a little bit longer because I don't really care. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I hope it tastes good. So we'll see. Okay, here's what it looks like out of the plastic in the box. Kinda looks pretty good. Let's put it in the oven for like I'll probably do like 12 minutes. Let's use the microwave timer. Timer 12. Oh, not even filming. Start. Oh, timer. Period. Okay, so it definitely smells like barbecue. Like strong. Is in there for 12 minutes, I think, was the complete. This is what it looks like. And honestly... I'm not liking the smell of it. I'm gonna let it cool down and then we'll do a taste test on camera. I already have a feeling that I'm going to hate it. I don't know why. Just like the smell of it and everything is kind of making me think that I'm really just not gonna like it. We're still gonna give it a shot. 
most likely I will just give the rest of it to my husband, but I'm praying it's good because I do need to eat lunch and it is like 2.30 now. I'm gonna let it cool off for a little bit. I'll get a slice. If I don't like it, we'll have to figure something else out, but yeah. Okay, another thing I did want to say about the pizza is it looks like there is not a lot of chicken on here. So, <laughs> that's great. I cut off a piece and I'm gonna take a bite of a piece that has chicken. It's like in the middle, of course, so. I'd rate it, ooh, spicy. What? Oh my God. Oh, not my exposure being like all the way up. I'd rate it like a seven out of 10. It's not, it is spicy. It's not terrible, but it's like not my favorite thing. I'll probably eat a little bit of it just so I have something. Also, we've been doing so good with our water intake today. I've been trying to like be on top of my water intake because I've been so bad. And we're already at 5 p.m. and it's only 2.36. So we're ahead of the game and I haven't had a soda yet. I did have a coffee, so I did have that. But I wasn't gonna give myself a soda till I not finished the water, but till I had a good amount already gone. And we did, so I'm probably gonna treat myself to a soda in a minute, but I think my mom's coming over today. I think, not 100% sure, but I'm gonna go and I will be back when it's dinner time. For dinner, we're doing tacos, and I think I'm gonna do ground, tur ground turkey tacos. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay guys, so it's time to cook dinner now. Um, I changed and had my hair up because I was finishing painting Oliver's room. Um, are you done? Thank you. Uh, we're gonna make tacos. Obviously, I already said that. So, it's really so simple. But you guys always say, I wanna see you cook the actual meal. So I have the meat defrosted or a little bit defrosted. It still has to defrost a little bit. But we're just gonna go ahead and cook it and it'll defrost while we cook it. And then I'm going to use this taco seasoning. I get it at Aldi, it's low sodium. We don't necessarily always use low sodium, but sometimes it's like all they have, so that's why we have it. And then we'll probably do guacamole, uh, salsa with chips. And I think that might be it. My husband might want quesadillas again, but I'm not 100% sure. We also still have some leftover chicken tacos. So I actually might use those. I actually might use that, see if my husband will let me use it. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking it real quick, and I'll be back. Okay, so he's watching Dino Ranch now because I need to cook and focus on that. But I have it cooking in here and it's like pretty much defrosted now, which is like so nice. And now I'm just gonna brown it. Then I'm gonna dump out the excess liquid, add the seasoning and then it's done. And then we're gonna assemble everything. And then I'll show you what it looks like. But this is what's for dinner. Okay guys, I forgot to film me assembling it, but I put guacamole on the bottom then I put this, I also, no, but I didn't use that. I use salsa, cheese, and then I put the chicken. And then I'm gonna have some of the taco meat that I just made in a little bit. And I'm also gonna get some salsa and chips on the side, but this is what I'm gonna have. You saw it in my last video, so I didn't think it was necessary to really show you guys exactly what I did, because I showed you making it. I showed me making it in the last one, so this is dinner. Okay guys, so I never ended this video. This lighting is making me look even paler than I already am and nothing is helping. Not even like going lower on my exposure. It just makes it worse. So, you're gonna have to deal with how the quality is at the end of the video, but I was really lazy during dinner time for this video because I was feeling really, really down that day. 
that I filmed it. I don't know what it was. I was just feeling very sad and I get in those moments every once in a while. It's not depression. I know for a fact I don't ever want to use that word because that is not a word to use lightly. Um, I just get sad moments and that's okay. Um, but that's what I had for dinner. It was freaking delicious. It's like one of delicious, delicious. It's one of my favorite dinners to make now. Like I'm kind of obsessed with it, but yeah. So that's it for that video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.